Upper tunnels control coming through from Navi Jr. Indicating that it will be an XE out to B. There is a quick backstab that could be presented. Bez as I set, USP tapping away, sees so many individuals, does find a kill on Demon before he burns himself, but one needs to get picked up and planted, there was a bit of a gap in that smoke to abuse there by the CT side, so Hansi comes in from the bat lines, the backstab against Frozik, uh, four versus three, Army Jr. going to try press to try and challenge these fights, Nipple able to get one back on towards Speedy alongside Unbroken, but Bunny trades back on Rendy on the side, both players know towards the outside of B, one more man down Unbroken, now left to be broken by Inspire with the headshot gain of the 2k and a pistol for Flames sent a good pressure coming through from the Danes you can see how quickly they want to initiate oh what a shot well done Rendy beautiful stuff against Bunny quick kill in from the mid doors the scout kicks things off wonderfully. Demon about to line up so much damage alongside Frozig wrecking apart Inspire forcing Speedy back he also dies through the smoke flames have been picked apart Rendy started it off. The main AWPer of the side up onto the scout, the 16-year-old hitting an absolute banger to come through from T-Spawn. And then from that point onwards, you could just see the pace, the acceleration catching the CTs off guard. And for Hansi and Fez, there should not be a way back in here at all. M4 held an elevator. Just not sure what to do with himself at this stage until Na'Vi start feeling the lineups. Two kills gained by Hans before he's traded. Nipple comes back in from the bat lines and deals with Fez. There'll be plenty to play with here. Leaving Fez, the lone man, playing anchor on the B site. Bunny tagged up towards the mid support. To turn his attention towards here pretty soon because the utility is coming in. Fez has been seen. High pressure, but Bunny's Deagle does strike on Demon. That's at least a decent frag of the AK. Swinging out, shot on from Frozig, get the kill on Inspire, and Bunny still got Fez on the backside, gets two kills, Frozig gets caught off guard, so he'll be even up to a two on two. And they've got to go for this, got to have the confidence to send themselves in, bomb to get planted, hands in to try and set up the incendiary, draw unbroken out. Pushing him away rather than drawing him into the fight. Make their way in from window into the fire where they just take the early damage and Nipple gets an easy kill. Headshot seen as speedy, but he trades back on Unbroken and Nipple catches him in the air. Advantage for Narvi Jr. 3-2 to the board. And Nipple and Unbroken were the two players that... CT player passive on that short position, trying to see if he can catch Nipple off guard. Meanwhile, from Narvi Jr., the walk forward comes in to the A site. Speedy, one point of health still. Flashed in, dead on the first face. Now just to this M4 as part of the defensive element. Fez and Bunny will know coming in towards tunnels that nobody's out here. But this doesn't look like it's going to be a retake to me. Inspires might, might catch Nipple. Oh, making noise in the jump though. It's going to be enough for the kill. And Nipple even turns around for the triple. Yeah, just getting as much out of this one as possible. Bunny kills prior to the ace. Hansi trying to get involved here with the SMG. Bunny's Deagle. Standing against it, faced upon by Frozik, and Frozik gets him down. Half by in this round, not working out for them. Inspire has caught a deagle back to a three on three, so they're still fighting for this here, Flames. They won't hold on to any advantage. And this is where the conversation's got to drive in forward of teams needing to close out these rounds with bad advantages. There was everything in favor there of Flames Ascent. They had a 5v2, even then to a 3v2. But not to be. The Eco trying to see if they can muster up some damage. Flash around the corner. Frozik completely blinded, just spamming through. Gets that kill onto Inspire. And for Speedy, might as well throw his hand at it. Give it a try. Oh, it's caught. Spray down by Frozik. Doing some damage, not quite the kill. Deagle also in. Footsteps early. Escapes or tries to do some. The fruition, though, is yet to be seen. Execution basis, Fez spraying a little bit early, does catch Frozik for damage, nipple caught off by Bunny, damage has been done, P250 with a tap towards Fez, the right to be a support, hands his orb also gets involved, but Demon again trying to find a way out of the situation, two kills of the Tech 9, AK in his hands, bomb plant tapped once, baiting the utility, but goes for the plant in the end. I've seen this before, Demon and Unbroken to hold off the post plant, smoke goes down, but Unbroken falls to the orb. Demon gets unaffected by that HE, backed up. Another 1v3 for Demon on the ace. Can't make it happen. Little bit panicky. Pressure by U2. Set up. You've got Demon on the site. One player in at mid. One player at lower tunnels to watch out for the rotations. Fares might be expecting a, a, a crunch in from him. 
Still it's the execution inbound. Na'Vi have Demon who can't hit his shots this time. Damage done to Inspire and Speedy. So the big box and he doesn't find anything. If it's a one for one trade, there's maybe some leverage into the rounds, but without it, you might as well just save, look for the force up, get those Deagles involved, allow the scout upgrade to come through, get that into the hands of... Gotta get rotators up and Nipple's gotta stay alive and do damage. Decent nay, doesn't do a mass amount of damage itself. Spray of the AK is extremely awkward here. Finally lines up two, only gets one. Play back from Hansi's good the block. Inspire caught a knife kill somewhere out towards CT. M4 now in his hands. Nades on money. Money's been gained. And the shots continue to ring in from the T side players. Demon with a kill. Inspire gets a dink back on towards one. Rendy finds Hansi. And now Inspire is all alone. Making their way up to the bomb site. Demon is extremely low. Flash in spray through. Rendy's down. Gotta go for the jump face. Barely seen him. Demon is on the defuse. And he has absolutely no idea. Inspire can get the triple. Recover that AK. But it's another round for Navi. Reface against the AK picked up by the CT side. Navi continue pushing closer and closer to the retake. Hansi known here. Damage being done to the HP bars. Fez tagged up heavy. Gets his kill alongside Hansi. Nipple with a deagle though. Strikes back with a triple. And just like that, it's all turned against him. The bomb's on the defuse. Hansi goes for the shot. I think he hit it as well, but it's the wrong player. The defuse is being held. It's still coming down. He doesn't land it. Demon, oh, he's going to escape with his life and steal it back for Navi Jr. Oh my goodness, there's so much. With his teammates, meanwhile, two CTs down at the tunnels. Recognize that nobody's here towards the B site. It's going to have to be the A play. A lot of retaking nades to come through from Na'Vi Jr. Hansi's still alive. Inspire clearing out the majority of the site. And this could come in quickly. Hansi's going to fall. That's the orb gone. Not for sure. And that's where the CTs are going to attack from. Nipple. Sub the flashbangs in. Inspire's going to get out of the way. Evade the flashes. Look towards CT and still lose his life. Fez now alone. A one on five. Can't do anything with it. 16-8 for Na'Vi Jr. They hold the...